9.51. I'm headed to the office for the first time since COVID, which is crazy. I haven't seen an office since the fall of 20, not the fall, the summer of 2019. Um, so I'm going in today, I'm gonna do ad week virtually and I'm just gonna work from my desk. And then tonight there's a Mary J. Blige and Jasmine Sullivan concert that my job sponsored. So I'm going to that and I'm really, really excited. But yeah, I'm just like at Jamaica station. I'm waiting for the Long Island Railroad. It's gonna be here in like three minutes. I'm gonna take that to Penn and then get on the A train one stop downtown to 14th and go to the office. So I'm super excited. Okay, you guys, the this whole is camera. Owen. <laughs> this is one of my friends. Yeah. <laughs> we saw each other in Duncan. It, it feels like the first day of school. It really does. It feels like the first day of school. I feel like if like I'm going to my freshman year of high school right now. <laughs> uh, hype as fuck, picked the outfit out the night before, all that. But I'm yeah, very excited. We're going inside, so yay. Yay to capitalism and working. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, obviously. <laughs> Not yay to capitalism, but yay to going to work for the first time since 2019. Vibes, yeah. It's like me and two other people on my floor right now. So I'm trying to be quiet because it's awkward. But yay. I'm so excited. Hey everyone, I'm Tyler. He, him. This is the Google office. First day here. Fun times. We got some exposed brick, we got some wood, we got some fake plants. We got plants. some gentrification yeah. fashion, I love it. We got fake so plants, cute. real plants, industry plants. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Goodbye, tell her no more. <laughs> Issa came back from the hospital, y'all. It's, not, it's broken. not broken. How exciting. <laughs> I don't know how to use this, but I'm the truth. I don't either, I'm not even touching that shit. Hi to the YouTube channel, y'all. Hi. That's Stephanie, and that's Lauren. First day in the office. <laughs> First, yes. It feels like the first day of school. It really does. <laughs> <laughs> it really does. There's Tate's Bake Shop in the micro kitchen. I love it here. That's one. Hmm. Hello, people. <laughs> it's fine. Just walk out where I can start off. <laughs> Hello people, I am in the office. I just had a meeting. I'm very tired. I'm now realizing how tiring being in the office is. Cause like I can't just hit my bed and get a nap and the nap pods are closed, um, which is sick. But they're gonna open tomorrow, right? Cause tomorrow's level two. Yeah, but you don't wanna be napping COVID times. They got wipes. <laughs> I don't, try, I don't, I don't know, like I, I think I need a nap pod. I'm really tired. Um, and then I drink Diet Coke and got no caffeine. So it's like, I'm about to make myself a little coffee. I hate coffee, but I'm about to make some coffee um, and get to work. I have a couple meetings. Can we just lunch, talk about how people that. send an email? I'm so sorry. Okay, you know what? Lauren has a rant. Lauren has a rant. How do you send an email at in the afternoon time and you acknowledge it's the afternoon time, but then get mad when you don't get a response the morning the next day? At least give people 24 to 48 hours to reply to an email, especially if they are not within your corporation. Like, why do you want me to badger our people? She's not wrong. Like, <laughs> she's not wrong. You're not wrong. Like, Speak on it. Like, <laughs> oh, she's been so responsive, so I'm just concerned because I haven't heard from her and I sent her an email last night. It is. You know, yeah, this, is, this is corporate. This is corporate life. They are because on the someone, somebody will be in California and they will send you an email at 7 p.m. California time, but that's 10 p.m. And then in they New wake York, up. and they wake up like, where is it? And I'm like, you sent it at 10 p.m. Like, what do you mean? I gotta go through things by priority, not based on how you sent it. Like, I got projects, I got things to do. So, like, that is the last thing on my mind for you it's wanting like, a, a, a cute little, little social boost. Like, please, please. Okay, lunch today was octopus. Um, hold on, let me pass the plate. Um, and I got a salad. Crystal's here. Hello, friend. How are we doing? Is this my best workload? It oh, is. Wait, you haven't seen any workloads. It is. It's cute. That's really Give it to us. My work fashion. Oh, oh, oh. We got, we got the whole thing. Yeah. The fit is giving. Okay. Let's do it again. I've been walking around this office for like 20 minutes trying to find the elevator that takes me to my floor and these doors They're locked. They won't let me out into the building. I'm fucking tired. I'm building up a sweat I'm about to just say fuck it and go home. I'm getting upset. This is irritating 
a very nice man showed me to the correct elevator. Yeah, I'm calm now, but <laughs> I was going through it. <laughs> I made it back to my desk. That was really painful. I was I was so upset. Like I I was really angry because like why can I find my desk? But it's okay now. Okay, so I'm done with my work day and Google is sponsoring a concert where Jasmine Sullivan and Mary J. Blige are performing so we're about to do that but I'm going to happy hour. Not even I'm going to happy hour, I am at happy hour. That's Peter. Same place I had my birthday dinner at so we're gonna get fucked up. Okay, we just left Temeraria. One thing about Temeraria, them drinks are gonna be strong as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> but shout out Mariana, our server. She also was a server when it was my birthday dinner. She gave us free cake. Love her, she's my favorite. But you guys, we're going. This is Issa, that's Faith. Crystal's in the back. Y'all know me already. We <laughs> are going to see Mary J. Blige, Jasmine Sullivan, Young Baby Tate for free. I love Google. I love this shit, I love tech. Anyways. Yep. <laughs> to corner social because i'm getting drinks with some friends but why did i just quite randomly meet my ex's new hookup and she's like oh do you know such and such and i'm like i do how do you know him it was super messy but like she's so nice i'm like i'm gonna hang out with her like we're gonna be friends but i'm like how is this man picking up these super fine super educated super attractive women Make it make sense.